Off of a day off yesterday after playing both Thursday and Friday. Long strides to the hoop. Hey, now in his second year after playing just a single year for the Bruins. Aaron Epps will let it fly and knock it down. They've taken four attempts from deep. They've hit three of England, facilitating, and now Jerome. Locates Brown underneath. Brown was there for the putback attempt, but never quite gripped it. Epps hit one, and now he hits again. He's got all six for Canton. Driving all the way in, Xavier Simpson. Blakeney from deep, and Canton has hit on all of its attempts from the field. But South Bay isn't at the single site, so of the teams participating, ranking has just such great work underneath. Located by Simpson, Pokushevsky pokes it away. And then he lost it as the teams trade turnovers. Sir Dominic Pointer racing in, and he'll score in transition through the defense. Jerome on the take, pivots. Shoots it over the smaller Blakeney and scores. Four minutes gone by. On the roll, Brown collects. Oklahoma City has reclaimed the lead. Blakeney into the paint. The floater stays down. 18-18 season. Also a prolific scorer where, when he played in China last year. Early stages. Sir Dominic Pointer all the way in. It's not this foreign distant land anymore. It's very much part of the NBA ecosystem. As Canton has extended the lead to three. Moses Brown, his own miss, up with the left hand, no, and he switches. All those shot attempts, 11 of them for Brown. Pretty sure all of them are in the paint. All of them in the painted area. That's where he has lived, as Simpson cannot find him. Instead, it's to Cleveland, and a couple more points in the paint for the blue in this opening quarter. Xavier Simpson. Four minutes to go, first quarter. Canton and Oklahoma City both at one and one. Omer Yurt seven continues the trend for Oklahoma City of scoring inside. As Oklahoma City has turned to its reserves. Same can be said for Canton. Each team with just one starter left in the game. Product of Michigan lays it in. Tight contest in this first quarter. Yurt seven finding Melvin Frazier Jr. on the cut. Sheldon Mack is driving in, finds Tyshawn Alexander. And he, his parent team, or the team that he is signed to, is Phoenix, as he tries again and knocks it down. Ryan Woolridge did on the last possession. Driving in, a travel might have been missed, and he took advantage of the lack of whistle. Final minute 25 of the opening quarter. And a tight one at that. Two potential targets ahead of the field. Mack off the dribble, got bumped, and one. Hesitation, Frazier Jr. got it back and laid it in. Woolridge ripping away that rebound. He has time. Frazier Jr. collects, fires, and cans a three. By a number of draft eligible prospects that hope to hear their name called in the 2021 NBA draft. At least two of them are projected to go top five. Jonathan Kuminga and Jalen Green. Driving in, nice layup. Here's seven. Might have gotten a piece of that. Jerome up ahead to Frazier Jr. 
Off the dribble, Malachi Richardson bags it for his first points. It's been played within two possessions the entire way. Frazier Jr., the steal, pushing the other way and scores it. Levi Randolph, denied. Anthony Lamb throws up a wild three. A bullet pass to Horde. After a clean start, now we've seen a bunch of turnovers. Pointer stays with it. Hesitation dribble, that's thrown up by Horde. Alexei Pokushevsky has returned. Beautiful feed. Xavier Simpson has returned to the lineup as Oklahoma City has called on its starters. And Pokushevsky drills it from straight away. Wake me. And one. A uh, corner was turned by Dotson, and nobody was there to meet him. Getting foul committed by Canton, so side out of bounds. Crossover, Simpson hangs and hits. Dotson tried to go right at him. Good defense by Simpson. Kick out Aaron Epps, and he cans a three. Four after an offensive rebound. Dotson blocked. There was Brown. Hard to imagine that NBA pros who make their living at the line would be okay with it. Pointer likes the matchup. So too does the rim. Pokushevsky into the paint. Oh, a nice finish. Beautifully with the offhand. Simpson. There's Simpson. Playing in tandem with Brown. Right into. Or maybe just switch over during halftime. But don't go too far. Oh, the slam off the dribble. Aaron Epps. Epps is the leading scorer for Canton in the first half. Good stroke by Randolph. 28 years old out of Alabama. Simpson pushing in and scores. Did everything but finish. That leads to a racing Sheldon Macko in the other way. Scoring against Cleveland on the run. Final minute of play, first half. Blakeney high off the glass. Such a tremendous finisher with a full head of steam. But Oklahoma City will make that trade. Gave up a two, made a three. But it's hard not to spot 11 in white on the floor. Alexei Pokushevsky, nice stroke. A minimum of at least 24 or 25 feet when he throws it up from deep. Antonius Cleveland, second side layup. Simpson, transition layup. Ty Jerome, backcourt defense, thrown right to Brown. And Brown was happily there in the backcourt to take it. Oh. Shifty. Easy into Epps. Epps, nice stroke. Hey, 
Brown. Omer Yurt 7 took the spot of Brown in the lineup. Jerome on the baseline. Pokushevsky takes it away from Yurt 7. He'll owe him something later. Simpson draining it from deep. Richardson, good find. Nearly pulled the trigger, but saw a wide open Mac. Pretty move for Jalen Horde. A 39, make it now 40 to 19 rebound advantage for Oklahoma City. Pretty spin and finish for Mac. Nice give and go. The continuation is there for Horde. High scoring performances, some high rebounding numbers, and Brown is working on both. Yurt seven on the offensive glass, and Horde, who missed the free throw, gets two more. And doing this without chasing Randall, who last game out scored 22. And has not seen any action today. Melvin Frazier Jr. No, you're seven, yes. One oh five sixty eight. Follow that up on Friday with a loss to Ignite. And because of this great surge to open up the second half, they're in position to cruise. There's Alexander. Rob Edwards sticks it from beyond the arc, his fourth made three. Quick trigger for Alexander, and he bags it. In the sixth spot in the early league standings, I'm David Resnick. These two teams playing from the ESPN wide world of sports. And now it's Malachi Richardson on the reload. Alexei Pokushevsky. Cleveland lost the handle on the run out. Devon Dobson picks it back up, splits two defenders. Side out. You shoot 47% from the Canton side, you think you're winning the game. Simpson to a cutting Cleveland. And I bring that up just because Randall has been one of their best scoring guards. As Brown on the inside. Both playing their high school ball in the state of New York. Lamb at 6'6", six, six, seven inches shorter than Brown. Simpson into a three. Under eight to play. Blakeney in the open floor. Heels. And a date to circle on your calendar as Brown throws it down for a career high. Midway through the fourth, Simpson wants Yurt seven. Back to Simpson, and he tees it up for a triple. Oklahoma City, that is now the single game high down in Florida. Austin and Erie each had 36 assists as a team four days of the year. Give and go for two more. With 15 games in 25 days, when you have the victory secure, it's probably wise to rest. Off the back of the iron for Lamb, and this is Frazier Jr. The follow, Yurt 7. 
fired for takeoff for Yurt 7. And a powerful follow. Lamb on the other end, a three. Good straight up defense, defending the drive by Mack. Oh, a powerful slam. Show off to Yurt 7, who's got the real hops. For Austin to go 4 0, and for Ignite as well. Oklahoma City beats the shot clock. Tough look, and it's banged down by Sheldon Mack. In points, matching Epps. Yurt seven just in front of the foul line. But even late in a blowout, Oklahoma City engaged. And that is a good sign if you were Grant Gibbs. That was back when the league was known as the D League. And the running joke was that the only D that you would find in the league was in the name. Oklahoma City led by as many as 38. A chance for Ignite to go 4-0 and and remain one of the three unbeatens in the league. 141-110 the final.